The Oregon Short Line Railroad was an important line in the history of rail, coming right through Salt Lake City. Established in 1881 as a subsidiary of the Union Pacific Company, it was designed to offer the shortest route between Oregon and Wyoming. An office was established for the railway in Salt Lake City, one of the major stopping points in the Oregon Short Line. The office stood on the west side of West Temple, just south of Second South, and was the repository of all the business records and offices for the Oregon Short Line workers in Salt Lake City. Unfortunately, the basement was also a storage facility for a number of violent chemicals. In the small hours of the morning of September 10, 1901, as the nation waited for news about the health of President William McKinley, who'd been shot just four days earlier, the chemicals in the basement of the Oregon Short Line building exploded, engulfing the entire building in flames. The Salt Lake City Fire Department raced to douse them. Four firefighters got injured in the process. They were able to save the surrounding buildings, but the Oregon Short Line Railroad office was destroyed and plans for a new rail line straight to Los Angeles were scrapped and never resumed. The Oregon Short Line operated under that name until 1987 when it was merged completely into the Union Pacific Railroad.